So um, I didn't really do very much with the birthday sale or um, write stuff, but I mean, there were a few things I spent, I think I spent most of the time in July just kind of getting updated on new releases for series that I'm currently collecting. Um, so I just got caught up on a few of those and I would say that there were some good weeks in the birthday sale, but there really wasn't much that I needed for my particular collection. Um, and then there was also uh, Barnes and Noble also had their uh, sale for the pages sale that they had at Christmas. Of course, it wasn't as good as the Christmas one. So I, I did go out looking for Erased, um, which is one of the few hardcovers that I actually really wanted to collect and actually sat, stood there contemplating whether or not I should start collecting JoJo's just because, but I said, no, no, we shall not spend the necessary money. But alas, it is the end of the month and we are gonna quick run through all of the titles that I am adding. So let's do that and I'll see you on the other end. All right, so we're starting off with singles and we have Blood on the Tracks Volume 9. I have literally been stalking this, waiting for the release and boy oh boy, Shujo. Okay, <laughs> Love Kill, we got Volume 8, had no idea that it was out, just kind of randomly walked in the store and I was like, okay. Hmm. So we also picked up Blue Here Volume 7, and we got the regular ass cover of Watakoi Love is Hot for Otaku Volume 6. I know, I know, this is my third one. I don't need it, but I'm getting it anyway. Okay? Thank you. <laughs> we picked up the final volume of Solo Leveling and V-Star Volume 19. <laughs> We also got a back order of Golden Kamui, um, so volume 30 is finally here, just two more to go and I can probably start reading this. Also found Kaiju number 8, volume 3, mm -hmm. yep, Ooh, and I finally finally decided that okay it's time I start like collecting Psycho Pass because I absolutely love this and boy oh boy is it gonna be hard but you know what we're doing it anyway. We also picked up Sakamoto Days volume 2. I haven't started reading this one yet, but uh, I'll probably get into it. I think volume three should be out soon though too. But yeah, these are my singles. Mm -hmm. Yeah, lots of really great stuff that came in and really the bulk of my order. Next for sets, we got um, Days on Fees, Days on Fests. I feel like it's fest, you know, like short for festival. I don't know. I so picked up volume one and three. We also got our back ordered um, Platinum N volume three. Five. Oh, baby <laughs> ah, perfect world volume 11 and 12 i ah, man it's finally come to an end and i'm truly gonna miss this oh yeah i'm gonna definitely have to make a video about this because oh if you're not on it you should be finally we scored volumes one two three of real it's been a journey it truly has been a journey trying to get all of these out of stock forever finally picked them up after missing several chances and we also got volume six so yeah really glad to have this and this my reel is really like filling out because this is the takahika inoue that i want to read okay so that's how we got this month um quite a few titles a lot of things i'm excited about ready to get caught up on so we we'll to be doing a little bit of reading because there are some things that i can really really want to find out what happens next so yeah, yeah. That's what we've added. Thank you so much for watching. Please come back, like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.